Hey everyone. <laughs> Hello. Welcome to Cyber Monday. Mm -hmm. Does it feel like it's so quick to be back here? Like we feel like we've gone through this whole like war of the Black Friday weekend and now we're here to Cyber Monday and we're like, okay, it's a little more chill, but still. <laughs> <laughs> it does it feels more relaxed like I just felt you know going into this I was like oh this is just gonna be we're just gonna kick back and we're just gonna hang out <laughs> I think it's a late, um, it's a late time too <laughs> yeah I was just gonna say um Marsha I saw your comment in the chat and um they showed 13 was it on Facebook and 12 on Instagram um, so you're probably missing the Instagram previews because they did show all 25. We could take and a look at them in a little bit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And there was that collage post that had them all too. Mm -hmm. so that, sh that showed them all. And hello to everybody else in chat. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you guys. Thanks for coming to hang out. Um, mm -hmm. I don't know. Like, for, it's it's weird because like. The, the last one on Black Friday was just, you know, all that long time ago. <laughs> we started earlier. And this is like, this is the time that the releases were last year. So mm -hmm. it's fun to just be back in the late night. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, I know, I'm Kate, a you're a total night owl. <laughs> and totally. like, I'm a total night owl. So. Yeah. <laughs> no, same. <laughs> We're all better for yeah. me, actually. Yeah. <laughs> everyone's asleep and I don't have to worry about anyone interrupting me. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, someone asked, did we know about, do we know about Cyber Monday releases? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Sometimes, you know what, sometimes we just have to say we don't know because we we can't say anything. So as far <laughs> as everyone else knows, we don't know. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. you know, until the official announcement's been made, it's you know. Schrodinger. It, it could have been changed. Who knows? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> oh. yeah is so did you guys bring in a huge haul at Black Friday? <laughs> did you guys get a ton of paintings? I got chat. Six. You too. <laughs> six for me. I'd say how many? Which ones did you get, Kate? Well, three were for me actually, and three were for my son. And um, yeah, so I got. Um, let me like pull up the thing so I say their titles right because. I might not. Okay, I got. I managed to get under the stairs because I was like lickety split on on the nose with it. Um, and then I also got Goddess of Spring and Memento Mori. And then my son got Inner Garden and Taurus and Aquarius by Chris Bug. Nice. He's col he's collecting the whole Zodiac Zodiac series. That's, That's so awesome. Fun. <laughs> Uh, well, Lindsay and I had talked about how honestly, like we got, mm -hmm. we just felt really, really lucky that we got to do sneak peeks for kind of mm -hmm. our topics, our personal yeah. topics. And so it was like, well, I don't, I think that's why we both kind of waffled <laughs> when we were shopping <laughs> at midnight, but I'm telling you what, I'm not waffling tonight. You're not going to hear me speak until I've checked out. No, exactly. <laughs> That I'm is true. Mm -hmm. I want more today. And then, so I'm getting four for me this time. And my son mm -hmm. wants two. So it's six again. And I got to be like so fast. <laughs> so fast. And I hope shop pay works. Cause that was a little bit of a, a weird thing going on. Cause like I was all ready to check out and then it told me I couldn't. So. Hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Which I guess like if, if anyone in chat like runs into that issue again, you know, it seems like there were, a mix of things that worked for people. <clears throat> I know Jacqueline had trouble like in the live, but when she like opened a, a window in incognito mode or private browsing, that worked yeah. for her. Oh, someone said okay. shop is still disabled. So. Oh, okay. Yeah. I got to log in early then so I can get my PayPal already. Yeah. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, they're saying shop pay. Yeah. Oh, you, did you say that is still disabled? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I saw somebody ask, I didn't get up for general release, so I did not get the paintings I missed. <laughs> no. I slept I, through it. Yeah. yeah. Well, you, you weren't feeling well either, so. 
That's true. I I like seriously woke up so so even more sick and so yeah, I just gave up. I didn't do any Black Friday shopping. <laughs> oh man. Oh. That so, stinks. It's probably yeah, good, I, you know. I slept but. through too. I I just was mm -hmm. completely I was passed out. And I like, I, I was supposed to have a therapy appointment that morning and I slept through that, like by accident. <laughs> <Oops>. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. um, yeah, I've seen yeah. a few people asking about like details as far as like, when is the release? So the release is happening in 54 minutes from now. Mm -hmm. And we don't know what the discount code is going to be. I saw someone ask about using points and just a reminder that you can't use both. It's either or when it comes to discount codes and points. Um, so I, you know, it's up to you to decide like what's the best way to spend your money. <laughs> <laughs> I see people asking about the restocks and we're not sure on that either, which ones they'll be or it's, we'll be surprised. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Genuinely, so we're not we're not making it up this time. Yeah, no. yeah. <laughs> <Let's get Connor. laughs> yeah. yeah, I saw some people saying that like they saw that there was there was already twenty five or something restocks today, and they wanted to confirm that those were not the twenty five restocks. And I was saying, I was saying no, right? Because it's Cyber Monday, they'll be releasing twenty five restocks. Yeah, that that's how I understood it. Mm -hmm. Okay, Wait. that's how I did too. Um, so. I would assume that you can use the app for this release because it's one release time for everybody. So it's not like diamond release and then a later um, general release. It's just, it's just this for everyone, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I would imagine the app would work. Mm -hmm. I saw a few people asking, yeah, I am feeling better. I've still got my Regula. <laughs> Best thing ever. <laughs> here with me tonight so oh. oh my gosh i see that and i hear the you know mm -hmm. their yodeling mm -hmm. thing that they did in their commercials <laughs> Ricola. Mm -hmm. yep good advertising <laughs> campaign <laughs> I feel like the, the bad ad campaigns are the ones where you remember the jingle, but you don't remember what it was advertising. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I have I have one. It's so I did the sneak peek for Miss Holly um in Black Friday. Oh, this is so random, but I've been telling Gary that every time I see her name, Miss Holly, you you know I have toddlers because I think Miss Holly had a dolly who was six, six, six. So she called the doctor. <laughs> Do you guys know that song? I've never At heard all. that one. <laughs> that, that's made its way into like the various like Netflix nursery rhyme, like mm -hmm. interesting songs. I don't think it was Miss Holly. Like, I, there was, it was it's Miss Polly. Else. It's Miss Polly. Okay. <laughs> it was like, but I just, I just, it's just so close. I just kept calling her Miss Holly had a dolly. <laughs> and I almost said it in the sneak peek because I just, anyway, the, the things that get stuck in your head. Mm hmm. Oh, you guys, you don't, you don't have to, you don't have to hide her. She was referring to a jingle that, that was like the, the song. I saw, I know who that is. Oh, okay. Catherine just timed out. I was like, no, she's fine. I know that looks like spam, but it wasn't spam. I know what she was doing. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. I missed it. Um, I saw somebody said, oh, Coco Melon. Because, yeah, Coco Melon, Dave and Ava. There's, there's quite a few now of those yeah. <laughs> toddler programs yeah. that all look identical. Mm -hmm. So, um. Uh, Lexi, uh, Sophie was supposed to have this sneak, it has a sneak peek for Catch Me by Mrs. Buttered, but she, um, ha is like out of town and cannot get internet service to save her life. Like it was, I felt so bad for her. Mm -hmm. So she was I'm trying really to hard to upload it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. I think that like half of the kits, they weren't in, in time to go out for sneak peeks or weren't received in time. So mm -hmm. You know, I don't know if first looks will go up for all of them, but can we talk about how like all the Margaret Morales ones got out though? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh yeah. Those yes. are on my list. <laughs> Those are on mine too. And I know I'm like, this is this is gonna be like we gotta be fast. I know. <laughs> yeah. That's I'm, all three of us, like we all love Margaret Morales. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I feel like that's that's something that 
like so many people have been excited for and and eagerly mm-hmm. awaiting. And so I just, I don't know, you guys, I swear I'm not trying to build hype, but I, I'm guessing you guys would agree that I feel like no matter how much Diamond Art Club has like bought for stock for this, that it's just, it's going to sell out fast. Mm-hmm. I have well. Yeah. So I'm worried. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> well, should I place two separate orders? <laughs> should I- <laughs> yeah just hurry and get as fast as you can the first one yeah I'm fine too bad there's not like a direct apple pay just like yeah, apple pay by apple pay by <laughs> with each oh. kit right that right be- but then you'd probably have to pay shipping for like each one each one yeah be- yeah true mm-hmm. true yeah I see somebody else again asking if I got what I missed. No, I did not get what I missed <laughs> in the general. It was too early. I, yeah, that, that was yeah. just too early for me. <laughs> I don't know about you. Like when I, you know, after I overslept it and then I thought about it, I was like, you know, like it's, it's okay. Like that wasn't a must have. It's not going to be like tonight where I'm like, I'm going to be really sad. <laughs> like there's a lot of kids that I really want tonight. But that one I was like, you know, it's, it's mm-hmm. okay. It's, you know. I must not mm-hmm. have needed it on race back, you know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I think last year was a BOGO, like a, a BOGO sale for Cyber Monday, but we we honestly we have no idea um what the sale's gonna be this year. Not mm-hmm. my department. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I didn't even like I'm look at me being a terrible hostess. Okay, so you guys know like Lindsay, because she was she was here, but if you don't, Emeralds and Fairy Lights, she's got a YouTube channel. Thank you. Kate, <laughs> weird. Um, so, Kate, do you want to do you want to talk about like what you do? And I don't know how much you want to share, but I know you're an artist. Like you, I'm an artist, art. yeah. And I've had a few kits released um, through Diamond Art Club, little Thanks. ones mostly, Thanks. snack size. Uh, but I also work at Diamond Art Club as um, the head of the rendering team. So, yeah, so fun. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Mm-hmm. But I always wonder, I'm like, what is it like to get to work on kits that you, you've like been a part of rendering? Um, I just think that must Amazing. be so fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's, it's also, sometimes it's like, oh, should I have done that? I don't know if I should have done that. You know, when I'm working yeah. on a little bitty part. <laughs> yeah. I was going to ask, I was going to say like, even though, you know, like you're, you're part of the process, right? Do you still like tweak things while you're working on it? <laughs> you um, know, like sometimes. if you're going yeah, sometimes yeah. because even though we do go pi- pixel by pixel, there are mm-hmm. times that I miss like one or two little pixels, and I'm like, that that doesn't need to be there, and I'll just mm-hmm. fill it in with the color that it probably should be. But it's just little <laughs> things like that mostly. <laughs> yeah. Either yeah. yes, I'm pixie sticks. Yeah. She's pixie sticks. I and love yes, a little snake mom. That's a snake right there, and there's oh. one back there, and there's one under here. And there's one over there, and there's a lot more upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Yes, um, Kate does have a YouTube channel. Yes, I have two, actually. I have one for my art that hasn't been updated in a long time, and one for my um, diamond art, too. Um, so Pixie Sticks is my art one. Diamond Painting and Dr. Pepper is my diamond painting one. Yay! You said you, I was going to say, you told me you might have a whipping chat coming soon. So yeah, it's filmed. I'm editing it, but I don't know. Maybe yeah. tomorrow. We'll see. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I was that. Um, those long, long videos, like whip and chats, are sometimes the longest to to edit, just because. <laughs> yeah, quite and long. I, I I have the worst time. I can't just. Katie, I don't know how you do it. She like totally just talks the whole time and doesn't ever have to like stop and cut stuff out. I'm like cutting stuff out left and right. <laughs> Can I say stupid stuff? There have been times, it, it doesn't happen often at this point, but like there have been times I've been like, you know, I'm just throwing out the whole whip and chat. I'm just going to refill it tomorrow. <laughs> That's what I had to do with this one. This is the third yeah. try. Third try. Yeah. But mostly I think like practice. Like I think you just, you know, I mean, I've been doing this for three and a half years. I think so is like Lindsay. And when we do it ev- almost every week, um, or at least, I, you know, I, I do mine every Monday. Like, well, at this point, it just goes a little bit like we're half. Um, People are saying really nice things in the chat and I'm having trouble keeping up. <laughs> um, someone asked, since I'm in charge, do I still get to render some of the kits or just do tweaks? Um, I typically don't render anything from start to finish, though I have 
in the past. Um, most of the time, I'm the last look at all the renders that, that get made, just to make sure that everything is good to go. And I also add all the special drills and decide where those go. Yeah, I'm sure I'm sure that she won't be able to answer like proprietary questions about rendering, but <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fun to hear about it. Um uh Lindsay, what's the yeah, someone pointed out what's the new picture behind you? You've switched it out. <laughs> yeah. What's the new picture? Oh, I'm actually in a different room. And oh. this is this is my family. It's like my family, a family picture. Oh. So not a diamond painting this time. <laughs> That's fun. Um and again, it's funny because it's a really big picture, and I'm just shocked that it looks so small. Yeah. <laughs> the um, I'm, I'm so sorry about the ads, you guys. I was really trying to go in and like see if like YouTube would let me tweak it. And it's like they started adding ads and live streams, and I totally get it. It's super annoying and super frustrating. I try to set it so they're at least like skippable. Like that was sort of the only thing it let me have control over, but Ugh, I'm so sorry, you guys. I agree. I hate when I'm watching a live stream and there are ads. So sorry. Me too, because it's not like you can pause. You have to miss right. whatever they're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and I've noticed even like because I, I have the stream running on my phone next to me and I don't I don't pay for YouTube premium. And so I see the ads pop up and I'll, you know, when when the video starts back up after the ads, it starts from the beginning of the video. And I'm like, okay, scroll back up. Oh, it's no. so annoying. Oh my gosh. That's awful. So <laughs> Sorry, you guys. I'm just laughing. Veronica keeps sending me messages in the chat, making fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I should respond to that. But, um, <laughs> well, it goes back to that time. I, I can't remember. I think it was like maybe a year ago that we were messing around with the settings and I accidentally put a background that was like a home foyer, foyer like, you know, in the background. And then people thought I was like lying or something. <laughs> like, going off my house or whatever. And I was like, no, it's just stuck. And I don't know how to get it off. <laughs> That's a weird flex, but okay. <laughs> uh, I do have to agree. People are talking about like the special drills and a lot of these Cyber Monday kits. And I, I've got to agree. Like mm -hmm. these Margaret Morales ones that have the metallics and the crystals. Oh. Uh, well, electro. Those are hard, those are hard <laughs> mm -hmm. to find a good place to use that makes sense. That's going to look good. And so it has to be specific artworks that are like set up that way. And so whenever I find a place where I think I can use it, I'm like, yeah, I'm going to use it. <laughs> <laughs> I so. love it. Mm -hmm. Well, not even just the Margaret Morales, but the um, Hannah Lynn that I did the sneak peek for that has all like the little, um, you know, what are they? fireflies <laughs> yeah like each one are are, are those crystals which i think is yeah. really cool yeah yeah i try to do it where it makes sense um so some get more than others because they make sense to have them and some don't so <laughs> um lindsay i don't know if i know you started one of your kits um uh -huh. i started my, one of mine and i actually have it mm -hmm. here i don't know if i have I mine too it? oh do you yeah we could <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Cause I actually, I want to show people where the special drills are in this one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I didn't get very far, but it's the, I did start on the Margaret Morales. This is dragon spirit. Can you make your screen bigger? Uh, I don't know if that's possible. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Uh. Boot y'all out. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. There you can kind of see it. Oh, she's sparkly. <laughs> Wow. Um, but then like, okay, let me see if I can get it up here so you can see. Uh, she has these gold marks like on her skin that are like, ah. <laughs> that was so weird. It's such a blast. And this is all those like iridescent crystal drills and the metallics. Oh, and those that's are, like, the gold marks like on her skin up here too. So it's going to be so pretty. That is. I'm so happy. And, <laughs> That's so I know when you showed where all of those drills go, I was like, dang, <laughs> that's going to be an awesome one. <laughs> How about yours, Lindsay? Mine doesn't have like um, any crystals or, but it does have one fairy dust. I haven't got to it yet. <gasps> oh, oh, wow. Pink. 
It is so pretty. It's really funny. I actually, <laughs> I was a little worried about the symbols because the symbols looked really stark on it. But once I started putting the drills down, I was like, oh my gosh, this is so well blended. It's so pretty and like, um, it's just gorgeous. Like it really captures that really soft look of it. It oh. is. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this little axolotl right here, got, he is He's so, so okay. cute. <laughs> it's <Ew>. opposite. So. <laughs> Just very fun. Oh my gosh. So shiny. And how this one does come in square and round, that's fun. Mm -hmm. I had people asking squares. about that. Right, you got squares. <laughs> that's so pretty. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. I love it. <laughs> and just for pink pink lovers, I don't I feel like Barbie is the main driver, but I'm just obsessed with hot pink stuff right now. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like this kit. I've got a pink tray. It's like it's perfect. I love it. So much pink. <laughs> <laughs> I'm um, kind of in the wrong season. I'm really struggling to get into like wanting to do Christmas. Now. <laughs> I'm hot working pink. on Yule by Miss yeah. Holly. So. Oh, that's oh, awesome. Yeah, I love that one. Mm -hmm. I'm loving the colors in that one. It's so pretty. That one is. That one just makes you happy. Like, I feel like there's just something about her paintings that, like, make you happy. Especially, I don't, yeah, anyway, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> they are. They're so happy. She has one that's, like, actually a little bit similar, similar to the Mrs. Buttered that's releasing mm -hmm. um, this mm -hmm. week that was in voting. Like, Miss Holly has one where she's standing in front of, like, a... A machine where it's like picking, where like it's like picking a stuffed animal or something. And I think oh, she's wearing a witch's hat. But I was like, ooh, I hope that one makes it through voting. Yeah, I saw that one too, and they are kind of similar. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Um, yes, Cassandra. Uh, who had the the Kitsune Margaret Morales one? Uh, the Onihime one. That, that was, was Mysteria. Yeah, Mysteria Brandy. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, I I don't know if I don't want to if one of the mods can go grab it or Nurse Rachel Nurse Rachel had the other the third Margaret Morales. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all the Margaret Morales got sneak peeks. Yeah, Satura was Nurse mm -hmm. Rachel and all of them. Satura, I don't know how to say it. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, people vote in the Diamond Art Club VIP Facebook group. They put voting up in there every I don't know a few weeks maybe. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I feel like people are always wondering where it is or if it is. If you have a friend in the group that sees it, just tell them to tag you on it. Because I feel like that's how I find it. I get alerted <laughs> to voting. I know they put it in the featured section, but sometimes they it's do. still hard to find. Mm -hmm. Well, and Dim uh, not Dime Club, Facebook is, like, really, really weird about, like, what they'll push as far as, like, mm -hmm. showing other people's feeds. And so I feel like it just doesn't even have the time show up and feeds so mm -hmm. um, someone asked how large are all of your DAC stashes um the I limit I'm in the minority of mine <laughs> <laughs> um, um I, ref I refuse to say I'll, I'll take the talent <laughs> I have less than a hundred still that's amazing <laughs> that's that's so that's so nice yeah <laughs> And I'm still wondering how I'm going to get them all done. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Uh, no, for sure triple digits. But I, mm -hmm. you know, I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's about to grow by like half a dozen more tonight. Uh -huh. <laughs> yep. I just did like a D stash where I got rid of a bunch of them. And I feel like just over the last month, I've gotten back twice fold. So I'm, like, <laughs> no. I'm not... Not doing very good. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, especially when it's like, oh man, they're regularly releasing artists that are ones that I feel like are basically must haves for me. Like Margaret's mm -hmm. gonna be one, like Chris the Bug, like Mrs. Butter, like all these artists. Yep, I'm like, all those. Okay, well, yep. <laughs> mm -hmm. But um, so somebody's asking, how often do we work on our kits? Like every day or for how long? Depends on the yeah. work day for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah, I mean, every day for sure. Like, I I mean, maybe every once in a while I might miss a day, but I like feel weird if I miss a day. <laughs> like a de-stressor. Mm-hmm. Um, I, the amount of time in a day just varies wildly, especially like it kind of depends. I know, especially like for Lindsay and I with young kids, like it, it depends mm-hmm. on what kind of day our kids are having. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you can imagine. So. Definitely. I think, I definitely think it comes down to, I probably do diamond paint every day, but that's because at a certain point I'm like, okay, everything I'm, you're going away and I'm de-stressing. I'm going to diamond paint <laughs> and listen to something. That's what I do too. Diamond paint and audiobook usually. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's a fun question. Mm-hmm. I don't know if you'll be able to answer it, but that's a fun question. <laughs> the one about the special drill? Uh-huh. That would be really fun. I'm not sure I, I can answer that. <laughs> I, I'll say I dream of a full fairy dust canvas would be just magic. Like that would, I dream of that. Mm-hmm. That's, mm-hmm. that's an interesting idea. So I have, um, you know, your unicorn that you mm-hmm. released your artwork. So I did it um, just regular. And then I did it with leftover ABs. I saw that. Yeah. <laughs> So, so my goal is to do it in all crystals, but now I'm like, do I need to do it in all fairy dust? At some point? So <laughs> yes, I'm gonna put twist. it. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna put you in charge of making sure that the, there's enough of the fairy dust drills in the different <laughs> kits that I can put them. <laughs> okay, let me get right on that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, this mm-hmm. Margaret Morales kit has two big bags of the white fairy dust. So, you know, just that's buy true. Dust. Okay. You yeah. need that one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Somebody's asking what I mean by unicorn. And so Kate or Pixie Sticks has artwork that is a unicorn diamond paint. Like it's a diamond painting of a unicorn. Yeah. It's just a little guy. Nine it's by nine. Little. <laughs> <laughs> Very cute. Did we want to look at oh, all of the? Oh, that's, that's probably a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> um, we're only half an hour away. Oh my mm-hmm. god. Okay, I've got. I did pull up the <clears throat> just for sake of ease. Um, the collage profile in the VIP group, so we can just kind of like go go through that and look at both like the Instagram and the Facebook ones. Oh, perfect. Um, just back to back and have the stats there too. Um, uh, this is what I actually, Lexi asked, like what I think that I originally thought they were asking, which is like wh- how we actually define the term unicorn versus how like it tends to get used. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> which I can, I'll grab, I'll grab these pictures. You can talk if you want. Like, okay. Well, so a unicorn, like as in a term unicorn painting traditionally, and this actually is not even started in diamond painting. This started like in cross stitch from what I've heard. And this means that it's a painting that is incredibly rare. It's not that it's like your ultimate painting. No, this is a painting that's incredibly rare. That's possibly just that's discontinued or um, very hard to find and that you love that you like will do anything to get. But the reason so is because like cross stitch and diamond painting, a lot of times licensings licenses are like, you know, they're changed or, (laughs) you know, so these patterns go out of stock. And so they become very difficult to find. I don't know. Did I did I just say that more complicated than it needed to be? Probably. I think it's a very sense. difficult painting to find. Yeah. Um, one second. Okay. We're distracted. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So we're we do the previews in a second. But I want to let you guys know that um, I don't think they're in chat right now, but we do have some gift cards to give away from Diamond Art Club. So huge oh. thank you to Diamond Art Club for yeah. um, surprising us with that again. We, that's so mm-hmm. sweet. Um, yes, so let me generous. pull up the giveaway tool really quick. Hold on, give me just a second. Do you guys want to come up with a keyword for people? Not, Don't put it in yet, but um, mm-hmm. what keyword? Just something that people have to type in to enter. How about electro, since there's so many electro drills in all these kits? Electro. Yeah. That's too hard to spell, though. I guess we could we could put it up in chat. Yeah, yeah. I think if people are typing it, then it will, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody joked we should make the word unicorn. 
That's easier to spell. Which, which one do you guys want? <laughs> Let's go with Electro. Electro. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Don't put it in chat yet, you guys. I have to actually start it. Um, and then I'm going to share the screen and then I'll, I'll tell you where to go when it's like safe to start. So hold on just a sec. Well, people already are going. That's fine. I think it's collecting, but, um, <laughs> okay. so, so yeah, go ahead and, uh, just type it one time. It's even if you type it multiple times, laying to collect your name once it's going to filter out duplicates. Um, mm -hmm. so we'll let this go for a, a couple minutes here. Um, and I will, I, I just, I feel so bad to like, like pound this <laughs> into the ground like I did on Friday, but uh, just a gentle reminder that when we do draw the winners, please don't try to claim a prize that's not yours. Um, let's not ruin it for everyone. <laughs> mm -hmm. And no uh, one did that the other night, right? No one did it the other night. I I was so, so happy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, probably because we did mention that like, well, the people that There's did consequences. Last time, they, yeah. <laughs> found themselves unable to shop at Diamond Art Club anymore. So um, anyway, so, oh, did it take away the, another screen sharing is there. Okay. Um, yeah, so don't spam the chat, just type it one time and you're, it collects your entry. Mm -hmm. And how many do we have? Did you say four? Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks Diamond Art Club. That is so nice of them. Huh. Um. Okay, so I see chat slowing down a bit. So I'm going to start drawing winners. And uh, you guys are going to see the giveaway tool when I go to draw. It's going to flash a handful of names. Don't panic. If it doesn't show yours, it's because there's mm, over 300 entries. So I'm going to show all of them. Um, and then it'll land on one and say congrats. And that person is just going to need to email me at diamondsandwashi at gmail.com. And I'll send you your code. Um, so yeah, okay, let's draw the first winner. Did I see, um, <laughs> do you see someone's? I thought I saw your name in there. Congrats Mine? You. But I oh, thought no. that's because you typed. <laughs> oh, that could be. Congrats, Mary. <laughs> Congratulations. Um, if you could send me an email at uh, diamondsandwashi at gmail.com and please include your name as it appears on YouTube here so that I know it is for you. So yay, congrats. Um, if you guys are just coming in and you haven't entered yet, you can type in the word electro and that'll enter you for the giveaway. You do not have to type it again as we continue drawing winners. It's going to draw from um, the same pool of people and continue collecting winners too. So yay, congrats. Okay, let's go again. Let's see. Yeah. Congratulations. Congratulations, winner number two. If you could just send me an email, please, diamondsandwashi at gmail.com and just include in the email your name as it appears on YouTube. So um, yes, all you have to do is type in Electro. You don't, if you already typed it once, you don't have to type it again. It's still pulling pulling from, from the same pool. So mm -hmm. um, yeah, congrats. Everyone's being so sweet in chat. We're going to keep... Mm -hmm pushing right through this because then we can get to previews yes. and we've got you guys we have 26 minutes till mark oh. morales time <laughs> <laughs> Daddy. Daddy. congratulations, congratulations. <laughs> yay that's winner number have, three mm -hmm. sorry were you gonna say something Oh, I should say people are saying, I saw my name and I'm like, yeah, this, this winning thing, it's kind of funny. It really drags it out. Like, <laughs> yeah. like it's like, kind of like, you know, like, oh, you could have been <laughs> rude. <laughs> so rude. close. <laughs> so rude. <laughs> All right. Let's draw our last winner. You guys. Good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody for this last one. Yeah, see, it just it just keeps going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations. Okay. Um, if you, Jennifer, I don't think I said as much to Maddie, if you guys could email me, diamondsandwashi at gmail.com. Uh, mods are putting it in the chat if you want to copy and paste. Um, and just include your name as it appears on YouTube. And I'll just you know give it a few minutes to make sure I don't have people trying to double claim that shouldn't. Remember, if you do try to claim a prize that isn't yours, 
it unfortunately will not really end well for you and we will find out. So uh, mm -hmm. let's just all, let's just have a nice evening together. <laughs> so, congrats to our winners and thank you. Yay. Thank you to the Human Art Club. That was so mm -hmm. incredibly generous of you guys. So yay. All right, should we hop back over to previews? Yeah. We have time. Let's look at all these pictures. It is, where are we? Here we go. <laughs> I'm getting an ad on my phone. Okay, so um, this first one here, this is Blueberry Fairy. Mm -hmm. And there's the render. Oh, that rendering looks so good. It's gorgeous. It's like so I pretty. It is. Like, I, I just, I just want to do this one just for the green. I, I know what. <laughs> that is when I saw that one, I was like, it's literally an emerald fairy, like Lindsay. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then this coffee mug, what's the name of this one? It says. I got to name that one. Beans that and it's brew. Yeah. Beans and brew. It's so cute. <laughs> And there's, I love that. It's just, it's so mm -hmm. nice and um, it's it's cozy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Especially with that little chocolate. Like I just want to grab it off the, <laughs> the plate right there. <laughs> right. Um, and the stats on those, let's see. Beans and Brew is 22 by 13 inches or 55.8 by 32.9 centimeters. Square with 30 colors, including one AB and two fairy dust. Mm -hmm. And then Blueberry Fairy was by Jamaica Murphy or Jamushka, which I love that name. <laughs> <laughs> um, 32 by 20 mm -hmm. inches or 81 by 50.7 centimeters, round with 59 colors, including three ABs and three fairy <laughs> dust. Yay. Okay. Oh, this one is on my list. Mm -hmm. Sarah Mustafa. Mm -hmm. um, I love her work. I'm trying to pull up the stats so I can read them off of my phone um, more easily. I don't know if Kate, you know them off the top of your head. Nope. <laughs> I sure that would be like serious, like genius level. I know. I do not yeah. have a photographic memory. <laughs> no. I mean, I thought about pulling up like the whole like big collage posts that they that they did, but it's it's so small, like you can't zoom it. Okay, yeah, I oh, do you want me to pull it up? I'll pull it up and I can zoom. Oh sure, yeah, that works. If you don't mind, if I can find Julia Catherine real quick. <laughs> yeah, I just searched for collages in the VIP group. Here's the rendering for that one. I love Sarah Mustafa's artwork, and I think it turns out so 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 beautifully. Mm -hmm. I love how she just adds colors to places you wouldn't expect to see them. It's my mm -hmm. mind doesn't do that. Like I'm very, <laughs> I don't know. Things have to go where they make sense in my brain to go. And she just, it, she makes it look great. Yeah. I don't know how she knows how to do that. <laughs> mm -hmm. looks so good. Um, so just for sake of time, I'm going to keep going and we can grab stats on these as, as, as they come up. Okay. A uh, Hannah Lynn. Lots of Hannah Lynn. Um, and this one is, is this a one that's dual charted? Is this round and square? I yep. Oh, so, yeah. Mm -hmm. this one both. Yes. Okay. So I'm on it. Um, so this one is um, either a 20 by 28 inch for the round or a 17.7. Is this what you want? 17.7 .7 inch by 24.7 inch in the square? Okay. Or do we want centimeters? Um, you know, <laughs> probably centimeters give you I, don't know. I don't know is that helpful <laughs> yeah. or do we want like the actual post because then they show like how many ab's but do we have time for that i don't no, know probably not honestly <laughs> elizabeth <laughs> asked if rika is still an artist with dac and she actually had a kit released during the black friday drop she so did. yes mm -hmm. she did um Oh, this is one. Oh, that's right. We were going to go and look at them like on the Diamond Art Club page just to see what the uh, what the like reactions to them were. But that's okay. That's okay. Oh, right. <laughs> that's okay. Yeah, the release is in 20 minutes. So we're just going to blitz through these really quickly. <laughs> uh -huh. But I am actually expecting this one to be really popular. This is from a new artist at Diamond Art Club. Mm -hmm. It's in squares. Yeah. 
I just have to put like a shout out. So I'm obsessed. I don't know what these little ghosties. I have oh. a ghostie sweater on right now. <laughs> oh, that's so fun. I just, I, yeah. Anyway, I was saying for some reason, I just like I'm in a little ghost mood. So they're really cute. It's so fun. Um, this one, this is so striking. Uh, the Equinox, I think is the name of this one. Mm -hmm. And there's the render. I don't know. This isn't normally my style, but I'm a little bit tempted by it, you guys. <laughs> it's really, really cool. I like mm -hmm. the one she did of just Persephone, too, that was released previously. Yes. Yeah. But this one's mm -hmm. really cool, too. It was gorgeous. I Yeah, I remember Persephone. I don't think I've seen anyone work on it, though. I have. I've yeah. seen, I think, one person work oh, on it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, we have another of our Mandy Manzano. Um Kind of like fish. tribute pieces with the fish. I almost talked about this one in the Black Friday Live. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> I was like in the fish one. Whoops! Well, because it's hard to decide like, which ones have actually released versus not like I'm going to work on. no. Whoops. Um, mm -hmm. But I think this was really cool. That one, anyway. <laughs> oh, yeah, and this one's dual charted as well. If you guys are bored after the Black Friday Live and you want to see a comparison, I've done a comparison between mm -hmm. the same kitten round and square drills. Um, I'm not, but, <gasps> you guys, how excited was everyone when these Margaret Morales previews dropped this morning at the same time? Mm -hmm. like, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, we did okay. drop that on us, just like three Margaret Morales. Three. In one day. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Coming for our wallet's hard. Oh, this one. That is one's amazing. my favorite. I just love it so much. It is. But I'm telling you what, Kate. That rendering is incredible. Like it amazing. is so good. Like, oh my gosh, it looks amazing. <laughs> so excited to work on that one. <laughs> I don't know if I can wait till next year's drills and chills because she's totally a witch. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Which is a good year round. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? I'm sure there's like probably some other theme you could probably fit it into. I'm sure, sure. there is. <laughs> um, okay. Sorry. <laughs> Restaurant notifications. This is one I saw like the hobbyist life talking about in her little recap of, of the, the video. It said that there's a ton of ABs in this one or, oh. or a ton of special drills. So I, I'm just so curious. I wonder like where those are. <laughs> I think the flowers mm -hmm. have a lot of them because they're mm -hmm. like the reds. Mm -hmm. really pretty. And then I think there's some in the lanterns, if I remember correctly. I can't remember them all, but. <laughs> you do a lot. Okay, this is <laughs> so fun. Oh, my gosh. Mm -hmm. That just. <laughs> <so> fun. <laughs> all the dinos. This one is so cool. It's just a little bit, it's a little bit overwhelming to me, just all of the <laughs> dinosaurs everywhere. Like it's one that you think I have to look at for a long time. Yeah. To like fully understand what is going that, on here. That also makes it fun to diamond paint because as you're mm -hmm. zooming on each little section, there's something new you're you're discovering. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're like unpacking. <laughs> so we have another Hannah Lynn. I actually think a lot mm -hmm. of people were looking forward to this one specifically. Like, mm -hmm. I've seen posts about this one, yeah. Mm-hmm. And then I love the red panda in this one. <laughs> so cute. Oh, that is cute. And I missed it. That is really cute. Oh. <laughs> so, so, so cute. I'm listening through because I'm looking at the clock. And I'm like, I gotta send out, I gotta send out those gift cards. I gotta get logged into my account. <laughs> mm -hmm. You got the bunny. Yeah, the bunny, of course. I love that Diamond Art Club just between Cyber Monday and Black Friday has been releasing all of these angel kits with the animals, like just so there's one for everyone. Yeah, especially something like that that's going to be really meaningful. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I saw someone ask just really quick in chat. Um, I think the Diamond Art Club still has Facebook Messenger kind of like turned off and all support requests need to go through their email. Mm -hmm. um, support at diamondartclub.com. This one was really kind of striking too. Mm -hmm. I think there's special drills in those sigils that are lit up, if I remember right. Ooh. Nice. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. And then we had, of yes, course. Yes, this butter. Oh, cute. Oh mm -hmm. my gosh. 
I love it. It's All the like love it. pastels. <laughs> I know. And this is the same character that's in Artist Room. So I'm excited. Oh, oh that is cute. That's I know so many people love it, but don't, you know, those claw machines just make you frustrated. <laughs> 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 so true. Um, another this one's one. Really the colors are really mm -hmm. striking in this one. Um, then Snoopy. Snoopy. Oh, this must be a little snack size kit, huh? Yeah, he's a little guy. <gasps> That's so cute. Mm -hmm. Very seasonally appropriate. Oh, another Abraham Hunter. Look at the little bears mm -hmm. back here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> mm -hmm. So cute. So cute. I've never done an Abraham Hunter, but every once in a while I go, do I maybe want to? <laughs> I guess that's <laughs> I've been waiting for his black bears. So mm -hmm. that one's tempting. Yeah. Um, this one's here. cute. Yeah. This one's Isn't one of my this yeah. <laughs> what, what? This Were you gonna say fan art? No, I was gonna say, isn't this one? A, it's it's a fan inspired art. by. It's inspired, inspired by. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that one was. I just don't know how far we can go in saying things. <laughs> yeah. Well, if it was fan art, we couldn't do it. Oh, okay. It's so inspired. it's inspired. Mm -hmm. So I was like, Good no job. one say anything. If you think it's fan art, don't say <laughs> anything. Okay. <laughs> No, I'm kidding. I'm not like you specifically, but generally speaking. <laughs> um, okay, she's gorgeous. I mean, I had the sneak peek for her, so I'm biased, but she looks incredible. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Another Yume. Um, and then we're getting close, you guys. Uh, this Chrisabug. <laughs> it looks so cool. This is a little one, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's Port I love portraits because you can make them smaller and still get all the detail in the face that you need. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then this, who saw this and didn't realize it was a Peggy Collins at first? Oh my gosh! Whoa. It's yeah, so did not. <laughs> I actually don't know who the artists are when I get the renders. Like that information doesn't come along with it. So sometimes I'm really surprised when it comes out. I'm like, mm -hmm. oh, that was by them. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, right. sometimes I can tell, but yeah, mm -hmm. forever the so Christopher Lavelle dolphins. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I had to double check confused? on that one. <laughs> yeah, I, I messaged. I was like, "Wait, guys, is this right? Are you sure?" <laughs> yeah. Now we've got our yeah, and I saw Kara loves that sugar skull. Mm. Kara is all oh, about yeah. it. Mm -hmm. I love it. There's our last you may. That's number twenty five. So Yay. pretty. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm gonna send out these gift card codes really quick. Um mm -hmm. if you guys want to talk about like I don't know, favorites or other other things like that. But um yeah, I'll be just silent for a minute here. <laughs> We're like almost T minus two, like 10 minutes, ah, right? Yeah. It's on your shopping list, Lindsay. So I'm trying to narrow it down, but definitely the Margaret Morales. And maybe the Emerald Fairy. Mm -hmm. I guess the Blueberry Fairy, but. Yeah. <laughs> she's a green fairy to me. <laughs> um, how about you? I am getting the three Margaret Malice ones and the Mrs. Butter. Because <laughs> I love both of those artists. And then my son is getting flower buns and one that came out at the Black Friday that he didn't get then. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Ooh. Oh, someone asked, um, how many hand render artists are there at DAC? I'm not sure I can say I'm that one. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Let's see. Um, we still, yeah, we still don't know what the discount is going to be. I'm thinking, will we get an email probably that will let us know? Or um, so at Black Friday, um, Diamond Art Club. Um, for the early release, just you just had to, to refresh, right, for the new releases. But since this is a general release, we don't have to be logged in to see them, right? Oh, probably not. Yeah, <laughs> but, but you want to be logged in. Sure. Yeah, so you can yeah. pay. 
<laughs> well, yeah, that of course. But I was just thinking, I because we could log in before we saw the discount. We could see the the paintings before we saw the discount right. last night. Mm. But yes, Wanda, no waffling tonight. <laughs> this is it serious. Is. We are down yeah. to business. <laughs> <laughs> um, when we, yeah, when this release goes live, you're just gonna hear dead silence and occasional frustrated noises from us. I think. <laughs> Am I ready? Seriously, I'll probably mute my mic so I'm not worried yeah. about making weird noises. <laughs> oh man! I'm like getting ready, like going on to the new arrivals. I'll wait. <laughs> I, um, I don't know. It's exciting. Let's see. Oh, somebody asked Kate if you have your favorite kit that you've charted to this day. Oh my yeah. gosh. I don't even know how I would narrow that down. Um, I love charting all the Ivy ones. Um, I don't know. Um, I did. Hmm. There are a few that I've had to redo from scratch because when they got to me, um, I just, I needed to start over. And so those ones are kind of a labor of love. <laughs> so whenever I see them, it's kind of a love hate thing. It's like, I spent a month on you, but you turned out so good. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. I find trying to like guess yeah. those kinds of things in my head. Like, of course, I'm never going to ask because I feel like that's crossing a line, but I just go like, I wonder if this was like just something that made Kate pull her hair out over. <laughs> Like, I wonder if this is one easy of those. to tell if it's one of those. <laughs> <laughs> Just like pure confetti, like weird, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, the, the people on my team are amazing, though, because if I had to do like everything from scratch, there, there's just no way. It takes me so long. I don't know how they get through the amount of renders they get through and they do it so well. And I just have to, you know, tweak like the last 20, 10 percent. I don't know. That's crazy to mm -hmm. me. Yeah. Do you ever like put more confetti in <laughs> because people like confetti? Yes. yes. <laughs> Cause I, you know, I, I just question this. I I've talked to Katie about this, but I did an unboxing of one mermaid, Uliana Bebenko. And I was like, this is the most confetti heavy kit. Well, I've it's ever <laughs> seen. Confetti helps blend <laughs> colors. So without confetti, mm -hmm. you can't get a nice blend. So sometimes I do have to mm -hmm. add more to make it smoother. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, so that one, that one's perfect. Which yeah, painting took people. longest to render? That is the Tea Party, is a Simone Candini <laughs> one with, with all the Alice in Wonderland characters. We'll never forget. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh, that's funny. That's funny because I think I even remember hearing that 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 was a kit that just. Yep. Was there was... any kits from this round that took you forever? Mm -hmm. You say I don't know. I'm thinking back through them. Um, I don't think I'm thinking of any that took longer than the usual like range. So mm -hmm. no, yeah, luckily no. <laughs> Um, I saw someone ask earlier um, what we think might sell out tonight first. Um, mm -hmm. I got. I think after I feel like the Margaret Morales, those kids. Mm -hmm. And then what else do you guys think? Maybe flower buns. People like you may a lot. Mm -hmm. um, the Mrs. Butter the Yeah, yeah, the Mrs. Yeah. Butter one. Yeah. Buttered, buttered or buttered D? Because I don't know how to say this. I don't name. know. It's capitalized, so that makes me yeah. think it's supposed to be buttered D. Yeah. But, but I say it Mrs. Buttered most of the time because it's okay. faster <laughs> and I'm lazy. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, people are saying they think Ghost Cafe will go. You know, when I was scrolling the social, social media, and just a couple hours before this live, this was... Mm -hmm. Um, before like the last couple of kits had like really previewed been, or been up for long um mm -hmm. that that one the ghost cafe one had like over a thousand likes on, on wow it. i was like 
Really? Wow. Ooh, shoot. Like, I think, yeah, I think that that one might, might go really, I think a lot of people have probably been looking forward to that artist. Mm-hmm. I, mean, I feel like I've seen her in voting a ton, mm-hmm. like the past several months. And so. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> um, I've been warning. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I saw somebody hoping that Cat Bookshelf will be a restock. Do you guys have any hopes for any certain restocks? Other than this recent Black Friday. <laughs> mm-hmm. I keep waffling on if I want to get Beachcomber's Bounty to do at some mm-hmm. point. You know, I feel like that's another one of those cases that it sort of would be like every section you open would be something new and fun to work on. And I've mm-hmm. seen it completed mm-hmm. and thought like, it's Oh wow. That's yeah. Um, mm-hmm. I really like Amy Stewart and I'm like, well, you know, I want to see more from her, but maybe I could just use this to like tide me over. <laughs> mm-hmm. I'm kind of hoping that nothing that I want. <laughs> is <restock. laughs> I'm already buying too much other things. <laughs> Good point. Good point. <laughs> This is almost like you have a great poker face, Kate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> I played a lot of poker in my day. <laughs> I have no poker face, except apparently on Black Friday when I was able to just completely yeah. lie through my teeth about Cyber Monday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> um, <laughs> Feeling a little bit of guilt over that, but I know. I, know. I always kept trying to kept trying to like say it in ways that it was like, well, I'm not lying. I'm saying, well, there's no official word from Diamond Art Club yet. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, totally valid. Mm-hmm. Three minutes. Three minutes. You guys logged in. I'm to- I'm still logged in from the other day. Mm. I didn't have to log in again. I I mean I would not take risks. I would go look, Kate. <laughs> I, I have something in my cart already, so oh, okay. we're good. Oh, shoot. I, like, loaded up my cart for really random. I better, like, fix that. Oh, no. <laughs> what do we think? Do we think computer or phone? What is going to be, like, the, the fastest way to go? I'm on a mission this time, you guys. Like, yeah. my friend who's sleeping, like, I am, like, I've, I have got to go. Like, <laughs> Yeah. If this friend is Jacqueline... <laughs> It's not actually. She oh, I I, set an alarm to try to wake up. Um, oh yeah, huh? yeah. I told Gary um, earlier today. I was like, I just feel so bad for Jacqueline, and he's like, "What happened?" And I'm like, "They are releasing so many athletes." <laughs> 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 he just Poor like rolls his eyes at me. Like, are you serious? I'm like, I'm I'm serious. <laughs> yeah, guys, oh, they're up. They're I'm up. seeing. I'm seeing them. So I'm turning You're off my them? mic now. Do we know the discount? Um, get 25% off everything code Cyber Monday. Okay. Ooh, code isn't working for me yet. I wonder if because it's not midnight. Um, do you have to go to the next page? Because that's what you have to do sometimes. Let me find out. There's a discount. I'm, yeah, I'll try. Oh, it's not working. It's not midnight technically yet. So maybe that's why. Oh, this is giving this is giving me heart palpitations. <laughs> Work. I know. Work. Cause what if we're sitting here trying to put the code in and people are like, oh, um, that's okay. I'm not even gonna um, worry about it. That says code isn't valid yet. I, I wonder if it's because it's not midnight. Wait the hey, second. I just put in the Black Friday code and it worked, but now it's midnight. I bet it's going to switch over to Cyber Monday. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. Oh, okay. 
should be good now. Okay, order number one went in, the must-haves, including stuff for friends. Now I'm going, I'm going back in. <laughs> oh. oh, my heart was pounding. <laughs> Woo, okay. Got the Margaret Morales. No waffling. Going back yes. in for the other stuff. I, You guys, I was really worried it was going to be a BOGO. And so I had planned out, as like an even number mm -hmm. of kits. Just oh, in case. yeah. <laughs> just in case. Okay. Are people talking about the restocks yet? Oh, I saw someone ask how you find them. You go under collections and then you go to back in stock. Should be. So got Ooh, Sakura Festival, Journey, oh, in, Journey the dark. in the Dark, Tennessee River Sunset. I saw somebody asking about that. Oh, where which? Starry Night Santa, Family Circus, Warm Witch, Fall Time. A Fairy Friend, Make Life Sweet, Together for Christmas, Still Waiting, Snowman Let It Snow, Next to You, Herbalist Helper, Gladys, My Kind of Crazy, Life Above the Fray, and then I think that's it for the 25. Is that, or maybe Gladys was the last. Or is Gladys, I don't know. Guys, th those Ooh. are all in the restocks. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm going back. I'm doing my second purchase and then I'll be free. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, Leticia, the code is Cyber Monday. It's Cyber Monday and you get 25% off. Okay. Whew. We're good. <laughs> <laughs> Got mine. Success. I bought seven. Oh my God. You guys, wow. Cyber <laughs> Monday, like Black Friday, mm -hmm. like even with the ones that I had for sneak peeks, like I still, there were not nearly this many that were like, this is it. This is, this is my taste. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cyber Monday got me good. So, so good. Yeah. <laughs> where, can you remind me where do you, where is it back in stock? Oh, I found it. Never mind. Yeah. You guys Just let watching. us know is, are you fine? Are you snagging what you wanted? I see people saying they're getting theirs. Okay. okay. Is anything selling out? I'm looking. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. Restock. You guys, I did that one a few years ago. It's so pretty. Like it's Which really, one? Really pretty. Starry Night Santa. Oh yeah. I guess you can look it. That's a that's a good one. It's it's smaller too. It's like not huge. I'm sorry, I cut you off when you were talking about the uh, if things were selling out. Who? I think I cut you off, Kate. <laughs> oh, moves to me. <laughs> I don't. I didn't see any selling out though, not yet. So I was, yeah, busy pulling them up. So I've got them. I'm gonna keep my eye on them because isn't this the fun part? I always talk about this I is like my fun. favorite sport. I have no vested <laughs> interest in this, but I love <laughs> to follow which yeah. sells out first. <laughs> okay, I'm just message my friend social. See the one that I got her too. She wanted a Margaret Morales and like that witch cafe kit, and I'm like, those are uh -huh. going to sell so fast. <laughs> I hope Jacqueline got hers. I see she's active on Instagram. So I'm like, Jacqueline, I hope you got it. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I see people saying they're getting theirs. Yay. Yay. Yeah, I see a lot of people, and I don't see any of them that look like they've sold out yet or even say low stock. So that's awesome. That's amazing. You know, I have to think, you know, I have to think that they had to know that Margaret Morales was going to be huge and like that they were just going to order a ton. I don't know, <laughs> but I have to imagine. I'm glad mm -hmm. I don't have that job of trying to guess. <laughs> Man, that's got to be so hard. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. And I feel like, I mean, how often do you guys feel like you're surprised by what ends up being really popular? You're like, really? Like, no offense, mm -hmm. but really? Like that one? Yeah. That was Sometimes, I mean, I'd say that happens a lot for me, but I don't have the same kind of like knowledge mm -hmm. about trends because I don't see all those numbers. So maybe mm -hmm. I'm, I'm one of the odd ones out, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
No, I do find it's fun. It's interesting how some things like can just be so beyond like your interest, but it's so popular and it just mm -hmm. kind of blows your mind. Like, wow, there's a lot of people that actually really like that. Yeah. Yeah. I was like a recent one. There were a couple on. Okay. Pastel pumpkins. Beautiful. I love pastels. I was like, really? Like, that's the one that's <laughs> going to be like, it's gone. And everyone's like, when's it coming back? <laughs> <laughs> and the yeah, my uncle's like, okay, emergency restart. <laughs> like, wow. I, wonder if it, I wonder if it reminded people of the um, Happy Jack's glitter mm -hmm. pumpkin stack. And it's like a, yeah. a fall version of that, maybe. So they wanted to pair them. I don't know. Mm -hmm. That could be. People are... Oh, that's funny. Someone, someone said, I am no longer still waiting. They must have gotten still waiting on a rest on the restock. Nice. Oh. <laughs> it's curious too. Um, I've noticed, and I don't know if that if it's just me, but it seems that squares seem to sell out before round when they're offered in both. Squares are more popular. Mm -hmm. I I will say that like I've been doing a lot of square kits lately and I really love them, but it has been so nice to be working on this, this kit and it's round drills. Like I'm like, Oh, it's going fast. And it's like, just, you know, relaxing. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, people are saying Gladys is low stock. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. I, and that's another one you guys. And I like, look, I'm the first person to look in the VIP grow, group and see people like artists shaming and being like, that's not what we do. Like that's, this is not how we behave. Let people but, love what they love. Let people love what they love. Let them be happy about it. Like it's fine. But I, I do have to say that like, I, I don't like Richard Lawrence. I think he's got really fun and cool artwork. It's not really my jam, but I am surprised by how many people are just all about it. It's not something that I would expect, but I think that's amazing mm -hmm. that like, yeah, Art offers that like style of artwork for people that are obviously like really, really into it. Um, mm -hmm. And so, yeah, I wonder like how many of, of those kits did they like stock up on for the restock? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Still selling mm -hmm. out. So. Oh, somebody says that Rosea is low stock. Uh-oh. Which one is Rosea? Oh, yep. It's low the stock. one that Lindsay's doing. Oh, mm -hmm. is it just one drill shape is low stock? Because I think some um, people forget to pick a drill shape sometimes. It's showing both round and square are low stock. Okay. <laughs> it's a gorgeous kit. It really is. Oh, I wonder how how Blueberry Fairy is doing. I, well, that's, you know, that's one I'm still so on the fence about. But I think I'm just going to enjoy it vicariously through other people. Because <laughs> I bought so many kits tonight. <laughs> But I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. So fun. Um, just looking. That chocolate on that beans and brew. It just still. Oh, my gosh. Like, am I just starving or hungry? Or just wanting chocolate. But I keep. <laughs> Ooh, I want it. <laughs> it's fun. And it's like. It's different, I feel like, because it's more of like a realistic. Like, it almost looks. Like, I don't know if it's a photo. But it like. It's almost, a photo. Mm -hmm. It is. Okay. Yeah. So that's really fun. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, the discount code, you guys, is Cyber Monday. One word, Cyber Monday, and it's 25% off. So uh, are there more restocks? Maybe. I think someone is saying maybe there were more restocks. Um, I'm so happy. Oh, seeing where is sold out in Rosea? Oh, wow. Wow. Mm -hmm. So I think that's the first sellout. That is. That's the first one. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised. Me I too. Have guessed that one. See, I'm glad I don't. I don't have to guess these. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Well, then it's a question of like, is it just because so much stock was ordered of the stuff they thought was going to be mm -hmm. popular, and that's why it hasn't? Yeah, it could be. Yeah. You know? <clears throat> See, those are the numbers that we don't know. So you know, we never. <laughs> but it's our so Saturday guess. morning spectator <laughs> or Monday night, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I, I love numbers and like analyzing and statistics. And it's like, Ooh, I want to know, like, how does, like, how does that work? How does someone decide? Like, how does it, <laughs> what does it do? I'm so fascinated. I am um, too, but I'd never want to have to have that responsibility. <laughs> 
I wonder if also because it's a later release time, if a lot of people like mm -hmm. they have work tomorrow and they're just like, I'm not staying up, I'll just shop whatever is, you know, that's possible. One morning. Mm -hmm. Oh shoot, so Lily feels. I forgot to add multi placers too. I was gonna add someone to my oh. order. Oh shoot. <laughs> Oh well. <laughs> I did go back in later in the day. So I missed the general release and got um I think it was Springbringer and Under the Stairs were the two that I was gonna try to get in general release. I missed those, but I did go back in later and got the multiplacers. I cut a bunch of them. <laughs> oh nice. enough to get to free shipping and use the discount. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I also went back for like the Kitsune, the the JoJo's art one. And I, I don't know why. Like I just kept, it's funny because I was complaining about it in the live. Like, oh, it's so monochrome, like chromatic. Like it's only whites and darks. And then I kept looking at it and I kept looking at it. And I'm like, I just want it. <laughs> I love JoJo's art. They have such dynamic pieces. Amazing. Mm-hmm. Pride was like one of my favorite kits that I've completed. Probably mm -hmm. like top five or ten completions. Me too. Mm -hmm. yeah. Pride is amazing. <laughs> yeah. It's hanging in my bathroom. Oh. Um, <laughs> it's I just think it's so funny that I missed the dragon in that. Mm -hmm. I don't know how I missed the dragon in it. He's only the biggest part. <laughs> <laughs> The shade. I think it was like Katie was talking about the finish, and I'm like, oh my gosh, there's a dragon in it. <laughs> oh man. Like I just focus on the lady and there's like the tiger. Uh, yeah, anyway. So I just I laugh every time I hear about that kit. I'm like, that is <laughs> that's one of the reasons I saw it and had to have it. I was like, I need that piece. And that one came out before I started working at Diamond Art Club. And I was I was asking Alex, I was like, is that going to come back in stock? Because it was out of stock on the site. And he's like, we have one in the warehouse. I'll send it to you. I was like, oh. Aww. <laughs> Aww. That's awesome. Let's see. Okay, I don't see any others that are low stock. Hey, amazing. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, is anyone taking advantage of if a mystery offer comes up? It offered me one, but I was like, no, 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 on my first order. And I was like, no, 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 no. We don't have time for this. I have to go back and play some stories. <laughs> I didn't take advantage of the one that it offered me either. I'm a chicken. <laughs> I don't I'm kind of like, well, if there are any any kits in stock or like on the website that I really wanted, I probably would have bought them by now. So do I really <laughs> <have> a mystery? <laughs> mm -hmm. um, oh, Allison. I'm pretty sure the one it offered me is Blue's Clues. I think that's probably the one it offered me too because it did say something about Blue. Mm -hmm. And it was like, I could tell it was a smaller kit because of the price that it was offering it at. So yeah, I bet that's what it was. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, let's see. I saw somebody said they purchased 10. 10. Whoa. Nice. Double digits. I mean, between Black Friday and Cyber Monday, I cracked mm -hmm. 10. <laughs> oh, um, Miss Buttered, um, her underwater train is now low stock. That was a restock. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Pretty sure I have that one. Let's see. We've got people. I'm checking which screen. baby? Someone said, look at my baby, but I'm like, which baby? <laughs> I know. I was like, wait, which? <laughs> Did one of my dogs get up? <laughs> I have two dogs sleeping in here right now. <laughs> mm -hmm. I spy an advent calendar in the background. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. I, I said I wasn't going to keep the box, and here I am keeping the box. I don't know why. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's pretty. <laughs> Oh like yeah, that's my my peer. Mm -hmm. It's funny the the box. I didn't clean it out. My boys have been plagued with it. Oh really? Like, nonstop, like putting their little toys in it. <laughs> it's a house. One of those flip books that have like the opening doors. Uh huh. <laughs> that's such a great idea. Oh my yeah. god, I should repurpose I know. it. Ooh, yeah, you can hide fun things in there. Hide snacks and make them work for their. Snacks, like, oh, yeah. 
or, or like do a DIY advent calendar. Who am I kidding? I don't DIY anything. I outsource that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Only because like the there's far and few people that can actually DIY stuff and it like be good and cheap. Most people are like, I'm gonna DIY this for four times the cost it would cost me to outsource it. <laughs> And a bunch of failed attempts is going to look like mm -hmm. half as, you know. Yeah. But if you love it, I love it for you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Guys, I just got a list in case we're curious of the ones that sold the most. Do we want to know? Ooh, yes. Is? Tell us. Okay, this so number one part. was Satura by Ooh. Margaret Mouse. My favorite. Mm -hmm. uh, number two, Dragon Spirit by Margaret Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> number three was Catch Me by Mrs. Buttered. Oh, okay. And then Peanuts came in at number four, Carolers. Yeah. Peanuts. Yeah. And then Onihime by Margaret mm -hmm. Mouse is number five. <laughs> wow. That's cool. awesome. Peanuts? Yeah, Peanuts number four. Oh, this is As like a Gen Z thing. Like, they're I know. Like, peanuts <laughs> what? Is like popular with Gen Z no, now. Peanuts would be more popular with my generation. I was, I was telling you. I was telling Katie earlier that Peanuts and especially Snoopy have had a resurgence with Gen Z. So if you're on TikTok, oh. a ton of Gen Z are obsessed with Snoopy. He's like the really? hero of their generation. I don't know. <laughs> if you cool. if you love it, I love it for it. Like I'm just like Snoop Peanuts. Yep. Okay, okay. I was so excited when we got Peanuts. Just I mean <laughs> nostalgia. I grew up watching all those. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm surprised that the, was it Witch Cafe? Like, given the reaction on social media, I'm surprised that wasn't, that didn't crack the top five, actually. No, it's number seven. Hmm. Huh. Yeah. Um, Summer Nights by Hannah Lynn is just above it after Onihime. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Well. Mm -hmm. And then Rosea, which was the first one to sell out, was uh -huh. number nine. And Flower Buns yeah. was just above that one. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I feel like we kind of, we did predict a lot of the popular ones. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. I did see a lot of people um, <clears throat> asking about the Summer Nights Hannah Lynn before, like, the release. You know, like, mm -hmm. I hope this one makes it to Black Friday or... I do have to say that you guys did an amazing job on the AB placement because I was talking about the crystals in the Summer Nights earlier. But the ABs, like you've got ABs in all of the red parts of Summer Nights. And then you'd like highlighted all of the greens with a green AB and all the water with a blue. Like I was really impressed with how many. I try to do that. I try to like, <laughs> yeah. if, there's, if there's a lot of different colors, I try to hi highlight like maybe the lightest color if I can to mm -hmm. show the light, the lighting in the piece, you know. Sometimes mm -hmm. it's not possible, but that's how I tend to go about it. Mm -hmm. You did an awesome job. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. It's my favorite. And I just, I love that I feel like fairy dust are sort of becoming a staple of kits because they're a little my more favorite. subtle than ABs. <laughs> what? Mm -hmm. They're my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They're easy to use because I can predict how they're going to look and I don't have to worry about you know, how to look in different lighting and whether it's going to throw the colors off too much. I can use them and be confident that they're going to look good where I put them. And mm -hmm. I love the other special drills too, but they're always just because they don't show up on the screen the way they're going to show up in real life, you know? Mm -hmm. So yeah. Yeah. I have to be careful. Yeah. <laughs> Well, and of course, like things like the electro ones that look have such a metallic sheen. It's like, well, like there's only so many kinds of artwork and spots that's going to work. <laughs> of course, yeah, they're really not something you can just use anywhere. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, yeah, they don't get the weird smell. That's true. Apparently, it's something with the process of how AB drills are created. Like the coating is put on them. Like AB smell like burning to me. <laughs> like if you, look at them, <laughs> yeah, like smells yeah, like I smell that too. It's weird. <laughs> It's so funny because I do not ever get that. Like, I don't know. Really? My smell's, my smell's been off. Sorry. <clears throat> my smell's been off since I had COVID in 2020. But I'm oh. like, I smell most things. Why don't I smell these drills? <laughs> I mean, I, I don't think you should have to complain about that, though. It's a, it's an odd smell. <laughs> yeah, I think I think Gary's, like, caught me multiple times, like, sniffing the bag. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> what am I missing? <laughs> yeah. You should be like, no, no, no. You smell. Do you smell? Do you smell it? Yeah. yeah. Well, okay, he lost his smell completely and has never gotten it back. No, really? Oh, yeah. No. Mm-hmm. Oh, no. So That's he can't so help awful. me. <laughs> yeah, oh, it is pretty awful. Mm-hmm. My my brother-in-law um, had an accident a while back where he hit his head on some concrete and mm-hmm. got a really bad concussion and it damaged the part of his brain that controls sense and he can't smell anything to this day either. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. It was scary. That is crazy. It's crazy that just things like that, like a sickness or, or just hitting the right spot, like. Yeah. You don't realize how much you depend on your sense of smell either. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like how do you enjoy food if you can't smell it? Mm -hmm. Okay, so someone commented, don't suck one up your nose. And I have a funny story about... (laughs) When you were were trying to get rid of the static? (laughs) Wait, wait, did you... Have you ever sucked up the turtles? I've I've inhaled a couple, I think. (laughs) Because look, look, I I, for YouTube, I'm like, all right, people say that like this trick works to help with static. So I'm like, okay, open the bag and like do like the humid like breath like <laughs> or whatever. And then like it like blew the drills like up and out. And like, I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> what is <laughs> happening right now? <laughs> so, and then, I just did that yesterday. <laughs> You're welcome, YouTube. Like <laughs> it's like it's awful because you don't mean to. Like it's a backdraft. Like you like you're like hey, you just breathe like hot. Like it's all of a sudden they're all in your mouth and it's like you can't pull them out. They're they're staticky. All it's a nightmare. It's a nightmare to me. I'd freak out. Well, and that's why I was like, okay, it happened to me twice, and I was like, you know what? You know what? Dryer sheets. It's fine. Yep. Like, <laughs> never get. I tried it. You can but, say you tried it. <laughs> because it's like, you know, then you have that feeling where you're like, is it just, did it just itch the back of my throat? Or is there a drill stuck in the back of my throat? Like, I can't nope. figure out if there's something there. So. I, was, I seriously, yesterday, I kept thinking they were in my mouth still. <laughs> oh. Do I still have a drill? There's... You blow your nose and you look at the <laughs> tissue. <laughs> and it sparkles. And you're like, mm. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just be doing it wrong there's people in chat like this has never happened to me like what are you talking about <laughs> some well, people are just more me, coordinated than <laughs> look <laughs> oh my god weekly diamond painters after dark podcast oh my gosh. <laughs> the stories we could tell <laughs> where's the weirdest place you found a drill <laughs> Not answering that question. <laughs> oh my god! Nope, nope, we're not going there. <laughs> All right, I'm going back to look and see if anything is sold out. <laughs> oh yeah, we haven't looked in a while. <laughs> oh my god! Um, is it Pie P Crafts is telling us it's not? We're not blowing out candles. We're blowing softly on hot tea. <laughs> remember but like even when i was doing that like doing the like okay you want like a humid breath like it's like or whatever i'm like i'm not blowing that hard but (laughs) the static is like just they're (laughs) leaping into my mouth (laughs) yeah gotta warm it up you gotta get it you know (laughs) (laughs) veronica excuse you (laughs) what'd she say to think this time on Friday, you guys were still shopping. <laughs> oh man, she's not wrong. Yeah. <laughs> but hey, oh goodness, oh man. I do have to say that, yeah, you know, we all have those things, and it all happens to do with either spilling drills or trying to get them to not be staticky. That you find them in places that. You'd rather not. Never expected. <laughs> I, f- I found them, you know, my kids are diapers. Like, I found them in my kids' diapers. And I'm like, no. Oh 
How? <laughs> what? You just gotta hope they didn't like grab a handful when you weren't looking or something. No, that like thankfully that was never. I don't know about you, Lindsay, but like that was never yeah. the thing with mine, really. Oh, good. Mm -mm. No, but my sister who has a one year old does. She does want to eat the drills all the time. <laughs> oh no. So. Oh, yeah. We always <laughs> joked with my James that um, the problem wasn't him eating things. The problem is getting things into his mouth. <laughs> yeah, I have that problem with my 14-year-old still. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I, yeah, yeah. We're all picky eaters in this house, all four of us. So it's yeah. just... <laughs> yep. It's a Here too. And it's all different things. It can't all be the same things mm -hmm. we're picky about, of course. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It is. <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh, baby Kate, Monica. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. I'm not. I'm not going to. I'm not going to say it. <laughs> you might not be alone, baby cakes. <laughs> Kate, <laughs> stories. <laughs> I'm just guessing here. You know. It's just, you don't know how, how to, I found it on my kids' mm -hmm. diapers. Like you just don't, they just, they leave places. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Viviana, mm -hmm. honest, I'll blame you for the Margaret Morales I purchased. I will happily take that blame by all the Margaret Morales. We need, we need more. Mm -hmm. I'm a huge enabler. Yes. Uh -huh. I, saw, I saw someone comment earlier. They're like, oh, I hope that, you know, we're going to see a lot more of Margaret Morales, the Diamond Art Club, especially like the Hades and Persephone. Which I did from the other I know. And I'm like, please, 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 please let my friend make it through because I want to do that like again and have it like done justice because I wasn't, you know, happy with how it was disappointing. So yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh my gosh, if Diamond Arc got this, especially seeing like how this one turned out, which I'm just gonna like pull it up again just because there's like there might be people who didn't see it at the beginning. And you need to see these Margaret Morales kids go buy it. Oh my gosh. Look at that sparkle. Mm. It is beautiful. And like <laughs> the rendering can be soft. Like it totally yeah. is soft. It looks so good. I mean, my whole the whole job is to try to get as close to the original as, as we can. And that's what we try to do. So mm -hmm. Yeah. Just laughing at Lily Phil says, now DAC will have to add a caution on the drill baggies <laughs> choking us. <laughs> <laughs> They're like if our content creators can't get it together, we can't, we can't don't let inhale. Do not inhale. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh my gosh! Yes. So funny. Uh, someone asked, "Do you remember what sold the most on Black Friday? What sold? Which was the one that sold out first? Like, oh, you know under, the under the oh, stairs. Oh yeah, stairs. under the stairs. Should I look? I think we had our chat." Let me see. It was under the stairs and then seating imagination. So the U maze. Mm. And then stained glass flower garden, which that one was surprising that that one was. So, I mean, I thought that one was cool, but I wouldn't have pegged that as like the number three mm -mm. most selling. I mean, that was like pretty early on in the evening. I wonder how much, if those numbers yeah. adjusted at all, like if it leveled out, like by the next day or something. I don't know. Mm hmm. I'm sure it, it varied a little. Yeah. I'm not mm -hmm. seeing low stock on anything else. I'm surprised. Mm -hmm. uh, do you do you guys know? I, I should probably know if anybody, but do you guys know how, how many are left when it says low stock? Because I don't know. I don't think I so. I don't. Okay. I thought I you I thought that that they used to have like 25 and then it would go down to Ten, low stock was 25 and then 10 they'd like count it down for you but then mm -hmm. they got rid of it and i don't know if they readjusted that i remember that i remember that too where it was like once it was under 10 it would tell you how many were were left mm -hmm. but then yeah they got rid of that that was like the, our first year of diamond painting that was covid times <laughs> mm -hmm. wow yeah that seems like yesterday but also so long ago <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> yeah it's a weird time thing. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, maybe because more people are asleep, that could be. I bet that that is part of it. It's a work day. I think that's part of it, yeah. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, I thought you were talking about, you were saying that was a weird time. <laughs> oh, <laughs> because a lot of people. Oh, were sorry. No, that I was did like, not. I'm sorry. I do that. <laughs> Well, that's a, that's an interesting perspective that we were asleep. <laughs> I kind of felt like we slept through some of that, maybe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> maybe I've just been seeing a lot of these videos lately where they talk about how, like, you know, the trauma, a lot of us have just, like, we've, we've put that in this section. Some of us are just waking up from it now, like, whoa, that, just, that happened, you know? And so for those of us that picked up diamond painting during the, the pandemic can be like, whoa, wake up. <laughs> we found a hobby and we made our lives about it. <laughs> right. Yep. But it's, I like, I can't see like diamond painting isn't going anywhere for me. It's like, oh, I found the thing. I found the thing that takes all the boxes that I need. <laughs> mm -hmm. I have to share it with my art hobby, but. It's it's a lot easier to diamond paint than it is to art because it's it's like it's just relaxing. I don't have to stress about how something's gonna turn out really. So mm -hmm. it's what I do when I need distraction. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I, I think it's it's awesome. The art like my my little James wants me to draw things all the time and he's really disappointed with with my artwork and I try to tell him like mommy doesn't know how to draw you so better get on that it. Lindsay start taking some classes you know? <laughs> the other day he insisted insisted I draw him Mickey Mouse I'm going to show you guys what happens when I oh. try to freehand Mickey Mouse <laughs> he colored it Oh my god, that's so cute! You can totally tell who it is. Yeah, I love it's it. It's like a a malevolent Mickey Mouse. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Have it turned into a diamond painting? It's not even close enough to be fan art. It's inspired. <laughs> it's inspired. <laughs> oh, my oh my god. It's Five Nights at Freddy's. <laughs> That's, That's what I was thinking. <laughs> well, I mean, mm -hmm. Disney does use animatronics sometimes, so that that checks out. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh! I think I am gonna um try to get him the dinosaur one that you did, Kate. That the diamond painting. Our, I was just thinking it's so awesome that you can draw your, you know. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, I did, I did that one for, you know, little kids who might want to, I know a lot of little kids especially really like dinosaurs. So mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm sorry if you can get, my dog is like sniffing the microphone and I hope he can't hear it. I don't hear anything. <laughs> okay, good. I can see I, his I little fluffy white booty. <laughs> yeah, I can see his booty. His head is up here. <laughs> Being petted. Oh. Well, and Kate, you actually, there were a couple of your uh, artworks that you created specifically with turning it into a diamond painting in mind too, right? Yeah, the unicorn one was that way. Yeah. Um, actually, I think all the nine by nine ones were that way. Mm -hmm. um, and I um, went into it knowing they were going to be that small. So it was easier to like keep in mind how big things needed to be. There he is. Um, in order to look good that small. So it's so fun. It's, it's a really awesome. Looking. I mm -hmm. I'm not even a kid and I enjoy those little nine by nines, so yeah, I do too. <laughs> <laughs> you said you have a polar bear. <laughs> so I do cool. have a polar bear. He's so cute. This is Baymax. Baymax. Oh, that is so cute. <laughs> so we have a Disney theme going on in our pet naming. Not all of them subscribe to it, but most of them do. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. <clears throat> my family, my family did that too. Like our dogs yeah. were all like we had Jasmine and my mom. Like Yorkies traditionally have three names, so her name was <laughs> Jasmine de Agraba. Oh wow, cool! <laughs> I love it. Super random. And that my dog was named um, Evangeline from the Princess and the Frog. Yeah, yeah. 
That's awesome. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. My other two dogs are Chewbacca, which oh. he was named before I think Star Wars was part of Disney, but it worked out. Mm -hmm. And yeah. <laughs> Lucy, which actually is a Disney character. It's a goose in, um, I want to say, 101 Dalmatians or Aristocats. Aristocats. Can't remember which one. Aristocats has the geese. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So she's Lucy, but we call her Goose a lot because Aww. Lucy Goose, you know. Cute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that is very cute. That's adorable. <laughs> yeah, um, I saw Tammy commented about how she loves small paintings. And I feel like I've seen a little bit of that, like in the in like the group, people saying, like, oh, I miss I miss round drill kits, or I miss like having some smaller, like everything just seems really big. I mean, I feel like especially Cyber Monday, a lot of these kits are on the smaller side and lots of round drill kits too. Mm -hmm. So hopefully that like scratches the itch for, for some people. People, I've noticed that people say that um, often, but when it comes time to do the voting, the ones that, that get voted on the most are the ones that need to be bigger. <laughs> so keep that in mind when you're voting. If you want some smaller kits to do, vote on some of the simpler ones. Because <laughs> we do go by what you guys vote on. That's a good point. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because you're right, that does seem to be what people post about. It's like the super highly detailed stuff. Like, this is what I voted for. This is my this is my favorite from voting. It's like, well, that's going to have to be really big. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I do so like cute. that a lot of the mm -hmm. paintings are being like done in round and square because the square tend to be smaller and that makes them a little bit easier, like of a smaller painting to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. For sure. I just, I went and looked again. Nothing else is low stock. I really? think nothing else. Wow. Mm -mm. I feel like morning, like we're really going to see it in the morning when people like wake up for the day. I think I some of them probably won't last long after tomorrow, yeah. I'm guessing. Yeah. I bet you're right. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, people may also still be hurting over Black Friday. That's definitely true. <laughs> it's so true. Oh, someone said Satura is low stock. Oh, is it? Oh, I'm not surprised. Oh, you got an email. Okay. As I say on the website, I don't see low stock, but. Oh, that's weird. It was one of those things where if you like put it, if you like look at it and like. Oh, website, if you click on it, maybe. Do the email. It's like, don't let this, you know, don't miss out on this one. You know, if you click on it and you go to the actual page, it says low stock at the top. Oh. Yeah, it's weird because usually it shows up in the list. Oh, there it is. I wonder if it was just updating because, Maybe. yeah, I do see that because I just refreshed. It wasn't and I refreshed and now it's low stock on there the listing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it crossed whatever threshold. So I'd be curious because we wouldn't know unless we knew how much was ordered of each of the Margaret Moraleses, right? So we're missing a piece of this equation. Yeah. <laughs> but which one is selling the most? That would be, that would be interesting. Well, we, we know that Satura is low stock. So if they got the same on all of them, and I don't know if mm -hmm. they did, then it would be that one. And that one was yeah. also number one seller too. So, mm -hmm. so it makes sense. Um, Lexi, the shipping fee for DAC, the standard shipping fee is $10, I think, but only if you buy less than $75 worth, because then it's free if you buy more than that. Yeah. And you can pay for expedited for 20, I think. But weirdly, I don't, sometimes I, Lindsay, didn't you test this? And like, sometimes the regular shipping was faster than the expedited. <laughs> I've just did it a couple times, and every single time, regular shipping has hmm. been faster. <laughs> but Barriers, who even knows? Except for I do hear, like, internationally, I think the expedited shipping is the way to go. So, I wouldn't... I don't know. That's just what I see in other groups. Yeah. I think so, too. 
I saw someone comment on earlier on, um, Sarah said, I didn't expect butterfly dreams from black Friday to be so massive until the sneak peek. I same, I wasn't expecting that one. If, to be you, if you look close at those pieces, you'll see they have a lot of tiny details, like, like little text details and stuff in the wings in order to render that it has to be pretty big. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Sometimes. That butterfly dreams, by the way, was so beautiful. <laughs> I oh. loved it, and the rendering. Wait, a different one. You did the little about butterflies. The yeah. Yeah, that one is really pretty. Mm -hmm. I almost got that one. I didn't. Though. But it is huge. It is huge. Yeah. It was like. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I thought I, I was like all the greens and like the darker colors and like the the surrounding area I was like that would do me in in a, in a piece this big so it's like you know it's a, like it's yeah it's got a fox <laughs> <laughs> that's fair yeah mm -hmm. um, I think um somebody's asking Katie which diamond yeah. painting you would recommend um for beginners if you're looking at like beginner kits we were kind of talking about how Kate actually some of her kits at Diamond Art Club are really beginner friendly so if you like go to the Diamond Art Club website and if you just search for pixie sticks, you'll see Kate's kids. <laughs> there's there's a few other small ones too. And I think there's a whole collection for there's beginner something. kits under collections. If you go there to collections is. and then beginner kits, then um, it shows you a lot of the smaller ones. Yeah. Yeah. I Yeah, I was, that's true. I was gonna, I think I could drop the link in chat just to try to make it easier. <clears throat> Excuse me, some beginner, beginner kits. There's fun ones in there. Mm -hmm. And I would even like, I don't even think of them as necessarily beginner kits so much as like, oh, those are my little, my snack break kits. <laughs> yeah, when you need that quick finish. <laughs> just to feel good about yourself. <laughs> I know, isn't it funny? It's funny when recommending diamond paintings to like beginners or newbies because um, one of the therapists that works with my little boys, she has been like asking me more about it. And so she was looking at some of the diamond paintings that I had out and um, she was saying like, oh, I love this one. So the one that she, she's never diamond painted before, but the one that she really loved and wanted to do was the um, Cheryl Baker, the rats in the window when it's a giant oh. diamond painting and i was like um <laughs> you might want to try like a little smaller what like that that's, that's a big project yeah. <laughs> for your <That'd> first. <laughs> but then again it's like you never know because mm -hmm. like my my first two kits were like unlicensed amazon kits that we pretend like those don't exist but my third mm -hmm. kit was like the um worth melting for mandy manzano princess panel that was as tall as i was and it took me a oh month to do like mm -hmm. that was my third kit but i was like i'm just i'm all in like this is this is totally something that i adore so mm -hmm. you know i don't know it's it's kind of it's like do you would that's she? the thing <laughs> i knew after like the first section i did on my first diamond painting kit I was like, I, I when I got it, I was thinking, this is probably going to be too tedious for me. I don't think I'm going to like it. And then I started mm -hmm. it and I was like, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And here we are. I know that's how, like, I know the date that I started diamond painting because I saw, thought the same thing. And I texted my mom a picture and I was like, holy crap, I am addicted. Like, this is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think about, I like, like I went back at one point and looked at my Amazon order history because I was like, when did I get that? Uh like mm -hmm. when did I actually get it in? So when I could say, like, when was my first like day of diamond painting? Mm -hmm. Um April 1st actually was mine, like not in April Fool's, mm -hmm. but that's apparently my I think. Is that right? Anyway, it doesn't matter. But yeah, uh -huh. same thing. It's like I worked on a, the first couple of sections, I was like, oh. Okay, yeah, I know this is this is working for my brain. <laughs> yep. <laughs> so you know pretty quickly. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. 
No, and it's those those just really cheap like off Amazon kits. And then I think after I did a few, the set of like four beach kits, I always say like I went on to Diamond Art Club. I'm sure it was Miss Coffee or Rachel Ray because I was watching both. And um, I go on and they had the Mandy Manzano, the Cheshire Cat, like just per got it. And like, you know, once I went back, I just couldn't go back, as I say. <laughs> So true. I, I I promise I don't try to mispronounce DAC in every live that we do, but sometimes it just calls for it. <laughs> um, Leopard Leatherworks Carrie asked how we display our diamond paintings when completed. I don't. I don't. I mean, I don't have a craft room, but like I, you know, I don't. You can see one of mine there. Yeah. I remember I that hang, in my in my office I hang the ones that I can fit um all of mine are hanging up over there except for my clementine one which is in the bathroom because it's framed but yeah um, most of them I roll up and keep somewhere else in a box <laughs> yeah I initially did the whole like oh I'll store, store them in a portfolio and I did this whole thing like I know Lindsay you did too with trying out portfolios with sleeves in them to like put diamond paintings in thing is if you like put more than like four or five canvases in those they weigh a ton like mm -hmm. it just is completely impractical and, and I gotta imagine they sag too if you're like carrying them <laughs> well if I would, if that would have worked, like if the weight wouldn't have been an issue, my plan was to use like glue dots to like secure oh, them in there good. so that they wouldn't move and they mm -hmm. wouldn't sag. But I just, I'm actually, I'm currently in the process of sort of mapping, mentally mapping out and kind of planning out um, instead of having them all stored flat in portfolios, which makes it a huge pain to get to if I want to like like pull them out and like show like and find something in particular instead I kind of want to roll them all up and like and group them by month like and put them in plastic sleeves and put those in totes because it's like if I have to then if I have to transport it I pick up a tote instead of a like giant portfolio <laughs> that weighs a million pounds that I feel like I can't even move like even pulling it out from under the bed is a Ooh. nightmare so wow. <laughs> I'm considering doing the like, let's roll them up and put them in totes instead and just put them in plastic sleeves and lab label it with like, okay, these are my January 2022 kits. These are my February 2022 kits. So, mm -hmm. huh? Oh, that's, that's a really good idea. I know. Cause mm -hmm. I feel like the same thing too. I just think that laying them flat or storing them flat, I've not found a good way. Even yeah. with the albums and things like that. So somebody was asking how you put them on the wall. And um, so I've never really hung them up either. But that canal home I put up on my wall just as a whim. I really want to get it framed. But I put it up on a wall that had already stuff kind of like kind of chunks. You know, a, a failed hanging up of another thing left some chunks in the wall. So I just nailed it to the wall. <laughs> oh, my God. Wow. <laughs> Wow. See, I just and use thumbtacks. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whatever works. I guess it's, mm -hmm, it's not going anywhere. It's <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, that's, that's strong enough to hold it up for sure. Spackle mm -hmm. and paint is for, I guess. <laughs> mm -hmm. I know. That's why I'm like, I'm going to have to spackle and paint this wall anyway. So might as well. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hmm. Veronica's, <laughs> Veronica's saying she's gonna do a box purge. Is that what you're just reading? <laughs> yeah. I I'm oh. really attached to. I don't think I can get the boxes. Mm -hmm. When I see I people like, like showing their stash box without, box. yeah. But is that how we're weirdly attached to the edges of our paintings too? Like mm -hmm. I removed some of the edges on my paintings and I can't remember it was you, Katie, and somebody else was like, what I can't did do, it. do. <laughs> Yeah. I was like, I, I can't. I just, I cannot. I have some of mine in those magnetic frames and you, you mm -hmm. have to cut the edges to get them in there. And every time I'm like, ooh, but they look good <laughs> and it's a cheap way to frame them. So 
I do it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. So apparently <laughs> Satura is sold out. Oh. Uh, okay. Mm hmm Yep. It sure is. I don't see low stock on anything else. It's just so funny. The time that we are super organized, like we know what we're getting, we're, we've got our list down, we check out as fast as we can, they're there. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Berta said, I've seen like the clothing rack and like hanging finished diamond paintings. And mm -hmm. I, this is not, I mean, I guess it's kind of a flex, but it's not supposed to be a flex. But when you've finished almost 150 diamond paintings, like they're just, that would be a really long rack and it's not space <laughs> practical. Mm -hmm. I don't know. What are your girl's numbers? <laughs> What's your number? Of finished <laughs> diamond paintings. <laughs> oh God. Um, What's your canvas count? <laughs> not nearly that many. <laughs> this really is diamond painting after dark, you guys. <laughs> Um, I just don't even know, actually. I'm of your I have number of finished though, mm -hmm. but I don't I know if it's count it. You um, don't? Do you not? Do you not track them? I do, but I oh, haven't this year. Okay. This, this so year, I know this, this whole year. This this whole year, I haven't like added the number up. <laughs> I know <laughs> you're just like what? It's been a rough year, okay. <laughs> Totally fair. No, sorry. <laughs> I'm not shaming you. I swear I'm not shaming you. I hate being number shamed. <laughs> no, no, it's more like, I because if I'm you and I haven't kept up with stuff for a year, I'll mm -hmm. never catch up. Like, I'm just, I'm okay. Yeah. Now I'm not tracking anymore. And it's just all hopeless. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to, I don't know that I have all of mine in here, but, but if mm -hmm. I do, it's 27 is how many I've finished. Total ever, so nice. Yeah, that's awesome. You also, I know, you I know. Full time job, and you do artwork. Like you're busy, and I'm mm -hmm. slow. <laughs> I'm slow too. <laughs> hey, I just think however you like to do it, because there's some people that like like to just single place. Like they say that's meditative. I find that not meditative. I like to multi place, which means that I do end up going faster. But you know, I think it's just whatever. <laughs> you you enjoy like you you like to do yeah i don't typically i do know rush yeah that too do because i don't know about you guys but i felt sad when i finished a diamond painting <laughs> like mm -hmm. this diamond painting that i i loved is over <laughs> i can't work on it I any felt longer that a few times definitely i'm like in that hangover phase with um what is my cat doing Sorry, if you have a cat, you know. Um, because <laughs> um, I just finished that you may glass piano kit, and I'm like, I really am seriously considering buying a second kit just to like have for someday if I ever want to work on it again because it made me so happy. Like, I don't know, is that have you guys ever done that where you're like, I want to buy us just a second to have in like reserve yep. or if I just need it. <laughs> in my life again another day <laughs> so we're gone <laughs> i will admit that i bought several copies of each of mine <laughs> but i do give them away sometimes or like mm -hmm. yeah but i have extra in case i want to do them again and i i would there have been a couple i've considered buying again because i like doing them so much like pride really loved that one yeah mm -hmm. yeah um, I've seen a couple of people ask about when they're um, like the tier resets, right? Or is it points mm -hmm. expiration? Or maybe it's both. But I think if you look in like the rewards section of your account, it'll tell you like your diamond through December 31st of this year or something, I think. I think if you mm -hmm. just hit diamond recently, then it would last all of next year till the end of December 24. Mm -hmm. This is the way I understand it. Yeah. Yeah. And then you just have to spend the 500 again during 2024 to have Excellent. the next year diamond yeah i did see a comment somebody was asking about what to do with paintings that you're not interested in anymore oh yeah I see, and I see. um <clears throat> i'm sorry guys <laughs> my throat 
But um, there's Facebook groups that like DAC fans is a really popular one that you can destash paintings in. Or there's also like eBay or Mercari places mm -hmm. that you that you can resell. Yeah, I've I've bought and sold on Mercari successfully, and I mean it takes fees, but like it's all like kind of tracked and really secure. Like there's a guarantee there from like Mercari, the business. <clears throat> And then, like, in DAC fans, they have, like, rules as far as, like, trying to keep you as protected as possible. Like, you know, only pay with PayPal goods and services and stuff like that. Um, but, yeah, definitely good routes to go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I feel like, buy, like it's, buying is a little, like, selling is a little slow right now, I feel like, with the holidays. But maybe when people start getting their tax returns early next year. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mm -hmm. so. I'm I'm nervous to like sell any kits because of the shipping. Like the shipping seems yeah. like how do you get a box to fit it if you didn't keep your shipping boxes and like I don't know. That's that's intimidating to me. <laughs> well, Lindsay and I, I know both of us when we did we knew we were gonna be doing some big D stashes. Um and I totally mooched off of Lindsay's expertise mm -hmm. on this, but you tracked down or you like measured, you're like, okay, these are the kind of standard size like boxes, and you mm -hmm. would bottom from Amazon, which it's like, yeah, a lot up front that you pay for a bunch of boxes because they don't really sell them in less than packs of like 25 or 20. They actually make that shape. To, mm -hmm. Yeah. Them. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. So, like, yeah. Um, yeah. so I have, I, mean, I have quite a, um, a couple packs of the, they're typically like 26 inches long or 32 inches long. And so I have a couple packs of those that I can hmm. use to ship. But I've got smarter now and I keep saving my boxes. But Gary yes. is so annoyed by this. He's like, why do we have so many Diamond Art Club empty boxes? <laughs> See, my husband would be annoyed with that too. <laughs> That's why I don't have mine anymore. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But that's kind of the route to go. And then you just use pirate ship. And yeah, it's in the continental US. It's usually somewhere in the ballpark of $15. But it's like if someone buys a ton of kits. Like I've Frankensteined boxes before uh, yeah. when I've had to like make a really big one. And then, you know, sometimes shipping will go up to like $25. But um, use a whole roll of tape. <laughs> uh, no, I totally get that's in that it's intimidating, though. It's one of the reasons I like put off <laughs> like doing a big d stash and then when i saw Lindsay doing hers i was like okay can you share your tips please <laughs> this is really intimidating to me so yeah and i just i but i feel like it is it's a little it's a little sad i feel like um the shipping just as like like somebody wanted a kit that i was selling that i know is like a kit that a lot of people want but they're in the UK and I'm like, I'm not a business. <laughs> Sorry. I don't yeah. get a discount. So I feel like that can be kind of sad with shipping as far as that goes, but I'm surprised at how much shipping has even just gone up in the last year. Yeah. For a yeah. Month. And I know I just saw a thing where it's going up again too. When there's holiday rates too. So it's like, mm -hmm. don't try to de-stash in December. Just wait till after the new year. <laughs> oh man. Mm hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I feel like I, I can't ship internet. I, I'm not comfortable shipping internationally either because I've had even like my quarterly Patreon gifts, which are just in these little like bubble mailers, like often get sent back to me because it's like even though I've tried to make sure I fill out the form exactly correctly, it's like you never know when it's not going to pass and it gets kicked back to you. I'm like, that would be a huge problem if that happened with kids. Um, yeah, it would. A lot of money to be out, like either for the buyer or for me. And it's, yeah, so it stinks, but. Mm -hmm. I have a friend who lives in Norway who sends me stuff all the time that she buys off eBay and stuff because they won't send to her. So then I keep stuff and then send it to her and I have to fill out those customs forms. And But I, I've literally had these for like three years because she doesn't want to pay the shipping yet. And I'm like, it's just going to go up. <laughs> like, <laughs> these are basically yeah. mine now. I mean, what's... <laughs> <laughs> I've got to go run and get um, a power because my laptop's going to die. I just got to notice. Oh. <laughs> I'll be right back. No worries. I mean, I might need to head off soon anyway. It's it's one o'clock and the kids go back to school tomorrow. So yeah. yeah. And Is it your turn to get up with them tomorrow? 
Yeah, Mondays Micah has speech therapy mm -hmm. in the mornings. And so it just that's I get up with the kids and you know take Connor to school and then come back and get Mike up and get him to speech. So oh boy. Yeah, I know my alarm is gonna go off at 7.15 in about six six hours. So <sighs> Bev's like, yes, sleep, please. She's <laughs> says Veronica. They're like, oh my gosh, we're so tired of modding this live. Let us go to bed. <laughs> Thank you so much for being Thanks here. For thank you. Thank you. Thank you, mods. We like, yes. worked you guys really hard between Black Friday and today. Been so, amazing. Yeah. Well, this is fun. It's like, it's, it's a little bit sad that it's like uh, over, like the Black Friday, like extravaganza and like this leading up to Cyber Monday. It's been like a week and a half of just it's crazy. Exciting. Yeah, it's such mm -hmm. a fun time of year. <laughs> so, it does. I wonder. I wonder if there will be any new releases this weekend, or if Diamond Arc is just gonna be like, give us, a, give us a week, you guys. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Good question. Genuinely, haven't heard anything, so I guess we'll we'll just we'll see. <laughs> I think a break. Is well deserved. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but you never know. Diamond Art Club surprises us. That's why I always say they always surprise us. Never sleep. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm gonna go take one more cursory look at the website and see if anything else is low stock or sold out just for for posterity. One hour after release. No, I don't see low stock on anything else. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Unless it's, I do not know. <laughs> you guys said I had a good poker face and now you're suspicious of me. <laughs> <laughs> no, Kate, Katie knows. I don't know anything ahead of time. I'm so out of the way. <laughs> Sometimes I'm filling you in like, hey. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not. I, li I sent Lindsay a message. Uh, earlier today, I was like, did, have you heard anything about next weekend? Like, did I just get, you know, mm -hmm. does Diamond Art Club hate me now? Do I get scared? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, for, no, for real. This isn't a, um, <laughs> we're not, um, yeah, we're not, we're not, a, we don't know anything, but we do. This is, we don't know anything and we don't know anything. <laughs> you sound so suspicious right now, Lindsay. <laughs> Okay, look at it this way. When that was not reassuring. Something, you guys had no clue that they knew something. So, <laughs> yeah. So me being suspicious means that I don't. I guess. Mm -hmm. Right. <laughs> We're really good at lying. We're really bad at telling the truth. <laughs> I I literally sent a message to I think to Katie. Um, because in the Diamond Art Club group, people in Cyber Monday were saying, oh, well, Diamonds and Washington, Emeralds and Fairlights were saying there's nothing for, like, they don't know anything about Cyber Monday, <laughs> you know? And I'm like, they are making me extremely uncomfortable in my lies. <laughs> we're so bad. We're terrible people. What have we done? <laughs> Created a web of lies. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be like, no, 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 no. Just, you read the room. Like, yeah. no one's saying anything. It's because there's nothing to say. <laughs> just keep saying diamond art club always takes care of us they're always surprising us mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and when there's official announcements from them that's when there's news so <laughs> i see lexi are, is that from parks and rec don't be suspicious don't be don't suspicious <laughs> i love parks and rec oh, so good such a good show it is a good one I didn't actually so. know that that little ditty was from Parks and Rec because I never watched it. <laughs> oh, I think a lot of people didn't know. Like, I remember seeing a TikTok go around naturally once it had migrated to Instagram and became a reel. And I saw Yeah, the, that's the how I knew about it. Yeah. <laughs> um, someone was like, oh, my gosh, like, I didn't realize that this was from, like, this TV show. Because I think that TikTok just uses the audio a lot. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. I don't know, that's from the most, <laughs> yep. like, unhinged characters on that show. <laughs> They really are the most unhinged. That's perfect. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh my gosh. I could not stand people like that in real life, but in a TV show, hysterical. I'm I'm here for it. 
<laughs> exactly. Oh man. What yes, time you is be up, Lindsay? Someone was asking. What? Oh, what time do I have to be up? Um just regular in the morning, eight or nine o'clock. So but I'm I'm just like a night owl kind of person. And so mm -hmm. same. Katie has to be up early. Wouldn't. early. Yeah, I, do. I should be up in six hours and I still have to like pack lunches and like set everything out for school. But I feel like the time change com had the complete opposite effect for me. Instead of it being like, oh, now I'm going to bed earlier, like a responsible adult, I started staying up later, like even later <laughs> than I was before the time change. And then we had a week off for Thanksgiving and I didn't have to get up with the kids for school or speech therapy. And I was like, well, I guess this is just my life now and I'm gonna <laughs> and I'm gonna be miserable when school starts back up, which is tomorrow. So oh boy. Anyway, this was fun. Mm -hmm. This was this really was fun. Thank you for inviting me. Thanks for yeah. hanging out. Thanks for inviting me too. Thanks for coming on. I was if I stand sit here and talk to myself, it'd be super awkward and a lot less fun. <laughs> <laughs> but yay. All right. Everyone go update your gems flow with your, with your purchases. Mm -hmm. um, and I guess we'll, we'll go talk to you guys again soon. Go check out these other girls on their channels and stuff. I linked them below in the description box too. So. Oh, thanks. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thanks for coming everybody. Yeah. We appreciate <laughs> you a lot. Okay. We'll say bye, I guess. Okay. Bye. <laughs> I'm so awkward. Like, how do we end this? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.